what I have learned. I have learned a lot. I've been pushed out of my comfort zone. I have done videos, I have done uh, presentation, mingled with people in the practice, and also I have conducted research. I can say that it's been awesome. For me, like the best thing about the course was that it's interdisciplinary, so or even transdisciplinary. So um, you didn't feel like you were within a confined space of research possibilities and opportunities. What I found the most interesting was the fact that we had different uh, professors from different backgrounds coming and explaining to us different topics as well related to climate change. I feel like there's a lot of opportunity in terms of research and that people are still looking for answers, researching more. And there's this whole community of researchers here that are really um, active. And I felt like the study I was doing was uh, actually contributing to something. So. Yeah. Just because I'm in a particular sector, I should not limit myself to it. I should be able to know the perspective of the other sectors and see how we can work together to achieve one common goal. It like opened my mind completely. Um, it was informative, but it was also challenging, sometimes overwhelming. Yeah, because it was, it was tough. It pushed me to that extent where, you know, sometimes you think this is what you can do. Then I came here and I realized I have greater potential. It was challenging, um, especially because it was really demanding in, te in terms of time. So like uh, to really learn how to budget my time better. And it was also very interesting because I learned like about a whole lot of different aspects of climate change. Like coming in, I think I thought of climate change more as just adaptation, maybe just vulnerability. Those are like the only things that I knew about. But like um, in this course, you learn about like economics of climate change, biodiversity and climate change and climate finance, which I found really interesting. I didn't know anything about those before. Well, it's very important for us to study climate change in Africa because Africa is already affected by climate change. I found that's a pretty urgent matter that we have to address, and especially in Africa, where all the risk and vulnerabilities are the most uh, important. Studying climate change for Africa is important to aid initiate policies that for adaptation and mitigation. Uh, there, is a, a, there is a dearth of um of, of, of specialists in, working in climate change and and and, and development, and and um, I would like to contribute towards that end. Growing up in Africa, I've always felt very close to these uh, social, economic, and environmental injustice, injustices, and I think that climate change really captures all of them in one topic, and it really brings uh, every discipline, every context uh, into the picture to address a problem that faces Africa as a whole. Africa has a lot of development challenges, poverty, food security issues, and um, challenges that affect people's livelihoods. So, and all those are linked to climate change. So I think that it's important for people to understand like the links and how they can um, mitigate them and how, how they can adapt to those challenges as well. I think with Africa being a developing continent, um, it's very important to understand the aspects of, of sustainable development within con um, in conjunction with climate change and how this is going to impact the dis development of the continent. Climate change affects food um, and agriculture and most of the African um, communities rely heavily on agriculture. So after studying conservation of endangered species I noted that um, climate change was a huge impact on um, loss of biodiversity and also um, land use change from agriculture. So it prompted me to sort of um, explore more on um, climate change. For me, like climate change and development are kind of two sides of the same coin. And it was really important for me to have a course that addresses both in almost equal measure, I suppose. Um, and then having a course that focuses on the African context is just amazing, like that's exactly what I wanted.